Hey everyone, it's Simon from Higher Plane Games. Hope you're well. This is a quick channel update for August and September of 2016. Anyway, I hope you are all well. So, um, plenty going on for August. I'm going to name August Awesome August because there's so many games that's coming out that I've been looking forward to for quite some time. Uh, coming out literally this Tuesday, I'll be doing some live streams of them and then some proper gameplay footage afterwards. Are uh, Abzu which looks like the underwater successor to Journey, uh, which is one of my favourite PS3 slash PS4 games, and it looks amazing, and I'm going to spend so much time fluting and swimming and being joyous. Following on with that as well is the game called Overcooked, which uh, you may see less gameplay footage of initially. There's going to be plenty of that uh, when I get some mates over and we'll get drunk. <laughs> Essentially is what that's about for. Uh, Four player cooking game. I'll oh, get out my way. That was terrible, Simon. Will I actually make it through now? Yes. Well done. <laughs> Only just. Um, so those come out on Tuesday. Then following on from that the following week, No Man's Sky is out. I'm hoping to get it. My finances are tight. Uh, but And that will be the game that will, I will drop if I can't get it straight away. But I'm very, very intrigued. Uh, especially because... Uh, not just me, but Esteban, the guy that does the wonderful videos with me on Formula One, uh, is also picking it up. So I'll be very interested to see what we can do on that. Uh, definitely Zero is his channel. Please do check him out and subscribe because he's funnier than me. <laughs> uh, and then the following week after that is F1 2016, which is what a lot of people come here to do is uh, the F1 games that I run. So mega excited for that coming out. Uh, it looks like the game that I've been asking for for a very long time with almost everything that I've asked for in it. So, fingers crossed that that will work quite nicely. The main <coughs> concern that I have is that it seems to say that the minimum specs are higher than what my PC currently runs. So I'm a bit concerned about whether or not me and Esteban will be able to do stuff straight out of the bag or if I need to really really save and update my PC. We should soon find out. <laughs> uh, but I'm getting on PS4 anyway. It's one of the few games where I'll double bubble and I'm quite happy to do so because of the amount of time I spend on these games. So yeah, look forward to that. And then right at the very end of the month, Project Diva X comes out. Uh, sadly is a digital only release in the UK and that's really pissed me off. So I'm not sure if I'm going to get the digital version from the European PSN store or yay, by the way, it is finished. Or if I'm going to import it from America and have a physical copy. I love Project Diva Future Tone, but it's got inbuilt um, stuff that stops you from being able to stream it, which is really annoying. So I, I'm hating this new thing about stopping people being able to stream and to show off their game, basically should tell people, it's great, go buy it. It's really annoying, I find it counterintuitive and counterproductive. So stop that, people. <laughs> uh, so, but I'll be getting that in a month. Uh, so yes, look forward to that. Ouch, is what I'm going to say to that. Bump through. Uh, following on from that, yay. Ooh, it's got an well done, I have, uh, September coming up afterwards, as does everyone else in the world, <laughs> and I'm going to be calling it provisionally Specky September. I'm going right the way back to the ZX Spectrum. I'm getting out my tapes. I'm getting out my floppy disks, and we are going proper 1980s gaming. And I think it'll be really interesting for people that weren't around at that time to see what gaming was. I'm now feeling very old, and for those that were, because there is a bit of a retro theme that goes on through my channel in general anyway, but not necessarily that far back, to kind of enjoy some of the games that were around at that time. And so some of you that are spoiled with F1 2016 may enjoy Nigel Matsell's Grand Prix world. <laughs> and stuff like that. We will soon see. So, yeah, there's going to be a collection of games throughout. I'm also going to be changing some of the way how my channel works, essentially. So, I've been doing loads and loads of live quick view... Um, like quick look videos and semi reviews and that's been primarily due to a complete lack of time on my end to be able to really sit and edit stuff properly 
So in response to that, because I don't necessarily like that as a going forward cause, is I will be doing shorter videos, but more of them. And my aim is to get out between four and five videos a week. Much more shorter, focused on a bit more on playing a game and just playing a level of something and having me idly chat over it, but not necessarily take it over. I know I'm not the most exciting person in the world, but I do have probably one of the best gaming collections out there. So, come for the games, stay for the normally quite drunk banter that will occasionally pop in. So yeah, I hope everyone is well. Uh, if you have any ZX Spectrum games that you really want to see, please do like and comment and tell me that, because I'll be rather intrigued. Uh, and lastly, but not least, um, if you feel it within your heart, there's a Patreon campaign that's going on as well. And you are welcome to go and sign up to that, where I'll start actually posting specific stuff and we can actually have a chat over there. <laughs> but until next time, you guys will take care and I shall see you across August and September. Take care. Bye.